everyone, Sirius Joe here, and today we'll be delving into Shooty Gatwa's 15th Doctor outfit, exploring where you can find all the parts to recreate this look. In this video, we'll be focusing on what seems to be his standard main brown outfit. So let's get started with the coat. The 15th Doctor wears a long female Alamo plaid coat. Unfortunately, as soon as this coat was identified, it quickly sold out on many websites. However, not all hope is lost. There might still be a chance to find the 15th Doctor's coat by searching for the coat's image on Google, or by using specific keywords like female Alamo coats. You might stumble upon a few websites that have one or two left in stock. For a more affordable alternative, Consider looking on different clothing retail sites or in the high street for similar looking brown plaid coats. There are plenty of different variations out there, so you might find a fairly accurate alternative. Moving on to the trousers, they are also by the same brand as the coat and fortunately are still available on the Outnut website at the time of recording this video. As always, for cheaper alternatives you could always search online as well as looking at different retail stores. Charity shops and Vinted might also be options worth exploring. It's also worth pointing out the Cost Daddy are currently selling a complete 15th Doctor look, minus the jumper and shoes. So that's also another option to look at. Now let's talk about the jumper. The 15th Doctor wears a short orange knit jumper and is the easiest and cheapest part of the outfit to find. The jumper comes from H&M and retails currently for around £15. However, if it happens to be out of stock or unavailable, there are several alternative places where you can search for similar looking jumpers. For footwear, the 15th Doctor wears a pair of Grenson Fred hand-painted leather tan shoes. I've included a couple of pairs just to show slight variations in the style. If you're on a budget, a simple pair of brown shoes will also work just fine. Finally, moving on to accessories. The 15th Doctor adds a touch of style to his outfit with some very fashionable jewellery, including some rings and a necklace. Although it's challenging to track down the exact pieces he wears, I've discovered a couple of places where you could find the correct necklace. On Cosplay Companion and Etsy, Alternatively, if these options both become unavailable, any oval shaped necklace pendant will do the trick. As for the origin of the rings, it remains a bit of a mystery. <coughs> but don't worry, a set of affordable silver rings can do the trick just as well to complete the look. At the time of making this video, there has been no official announcement of the 15th Doctor Sonic Screwdriver replica. However, character options will most likely make one available soon, so check the description to see if I've included a link. For now, a Sky Remote or any other TV remote will work in a pinch. And there you have it, a comprehensive look at Shooty Gatwa's 15th Doctor outfit along with some alternative options for those hard to find pieces. As always, make sure to check the description for additional links to everything. Thank you everyone so much for watching. If you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe and click that bell. And I will see you all in the next video.